Former WNBA star Katie Smith retired as the all-time leading scorer in U.S. women's professional basketball history. Now she's going from New York Liberty player to New York Liberty coach. I'm Kerry Chow for ESPNW, and joining me on the phone is the Katie Smith. Katie, you announced your retirement at the beginning of this season. Now you're going straight into coaching. So the question is, have you been able to enjoy the fruits of retirement? You know, it's it's been rough. I mean, it's been fun to be retired. A lot of people have paid attention and know, but I, I am uh, in my last year of grad school. So I it, basically I was in school the last month of uh, the season. So honestly, it hasn't. It's been quite busy, um, but in a different way. Uh, I'm just trying to grind through this and get things done so that I can uh, you know get ready for the summer to be a coach. And speaking of being a coach, what do you think will be the biggest challenge moving from player to coach? Yeah, you know, this is the the time and the um, the preparation of practice and and all the and, and trying to communicate it to the players on so that they can execute it and, and they can do what you kind of visualize. So um, I know as players, you know, you come in for a couple hours and go to practice, and yeah, you think about it when you're you go home, but not as much as what the coaches do. You know, it's an all day thing uh, to prep uh, not only for practice but the team for the game. What's it going to be like to coach with Bill Lane Beer? You know, I'm looking forward to it. You know, our history and, and um, you know, the time we spent together was a real mutual um, uh, respect slash working environment where we always had dialogue and uh, we're able to run things by each other. And, you know, he'd ask you, I, I'd tell him stuff and ask him things. So it was a real open, um, it's really easy. Somebody who really, it doesn't really matter if he agrees or disagrees, you can say things and he'll, he'll make the final decision. Take me into one of those practices. What's the language like? Because we hear a lot about the Bill Lambeer's language. You know, Bill's not that bad. I mean, he has his moments. But he just he just is normal. You know, he and he's not a. I think people like obviously Bill. He's 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 a, he's a mess some days, but um, he's not a he's not a rant and raven type of guy. Um, you know, he's somebody who basically gives it to you straight. Um, if you don't, if you don't have it that day, you don't have it that day, and that's that kind of how he leaves it. But he expects a lot out of you, and expects you to motivate yourself and to, you know, have that standard every day. You were known during your playing days as having a lot of swagger. What kind of coach do you think you'll be? Will you be one of those the ranting types? You know, if I'm gonna be a coach with a lot of swagger, you want your team to have swagger. Um, you know, it's 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 hard. I mean, I just want to be able to to give. Basically, have a, a, a game plan and try to bring out the best in each player because we're all so very, very different. When we know I was a player, everybody brings different things to the table. Everybody's role is different, and uh, you know we really just want to make sure that we're getting everything out of each person and, and that they really locked into what their role is to help us win. Lastly, Katie, you're one of the most decorated women's players of all time. Actually, male or female, one of the most decorated basketball players of all time. What are you going to miss the most from playing? Hey, you know, just the, the dynamic, the, the interaction of the players, the day-to-day um, camaraderie, uh, just, that, just that, the relationships on that side of it. Because now you move it over into a different, different venue um, outside of the locker room, per se. So I'm just going to miss that, just the travel and the... Camaraderie. You think you'll have that urge to be a player coach? Oh no, no player coach here. I think I'm. I think I made it. I got everything I could out of this body when it comes to basketball. <laughs> <laughs> Great stuff. You got an awful lot out. Two-time WNBA champion, three-time Olympic gold medalist, seven-time WNBA All-Star. Great stuff, Katie Smith. We appreciate you joining us for ESPNW. Hey, thank you. It's been a blast. I'm Kerry Chow. Be sure to keep it on ESPNW for all your latest news.